<clears throat> All right, so <clears throat> tonight I'm having dinner and I photographed this for my blog, but I didn't videotape it, uh, preparing it, and then I started eating it and I thought, oh my god, I can't let this, I can't pass this up. Um, let me tell you what's in here. There's one Brussels sprout that is just sliced very thinly, um, one whole ear of corn, a tiny bit of purple cabbage. I, I cut off like little triangles off of the cabbage and slowly go eat away at it. And then that's chopped up, diced up really fine. Um, there's sprouted um, buckwheat in here and I got the idea to sprout. I've sprouted buckwheat before for pizzas that I make. But um, I saw another YouTube video where a gentleman used the sprouted buckwheats with a frozen banana and little filtered water in a shake in the morning. He put protein powder in it, but um, you could do chia seeds or flax seeds for protein. Um, but it was delicious. And then so I had these uh, sprouted buckwheats here. And then I, I just love goat cheese. Um, goat cheese is wonderful. So um, I put a couple slices of goat cheese on there and then I am just eating up and using up some of my almond flax, uh, rosemary almond flax crackers. And these are really, they're really nice because they're super crisp. Um, they just snap and they're really small but um, they're really yummy. And then I put, um, I put some uh, rock salt on top of that while I'm dehydrating it. So anyway, I just, I, I couldn't pass that up because it's really good. The corn is delicious. It's a good meal for one person and I didn't put any salt, any pepper, any oil. All I did was cut up vegetables and some cheese and the cheese is really good. It just, it, um, it balances out with the corn. The corn is super, super sweet. So I hope you give it a try and um, uh, I know the crackers are not easy because you have to have a dehydrator to do that. But um, you could toast, put some uh, brown rice toast or whatever your favorite bread maybe something because you need something sort of crispy with this and that's why it works all right so enjoy just one more thing I wanted to bring up and that's chewing I know I've said it before um, but it really bears repeating uh, digestion begins in the mouth and so when you're eating something like this which is corn corn corn's one of those things that we chew and we like the sweet and we you know once it pops the sweet pops in our mouth we sort of swallow it because we think oh it's given us our you know our treat um, and that's not the case. Corn, you really need to chew and liquefy your food in your mouth before you swallow it. And then just remember this, it doesn't matter what you don't chew, it matters what you do chew. So if you are, you know, you, you swallow and you're like, oh my god, I didn't chew that, don't worry about it, let it go. Chew the next thing. <laughs> Alright? So anyway, enjoy.